Okay, due to unforeseen circumstances, I'm now here at Sandown for race 31, which is a two mile six furlong, 0 to 100 handicap. On the soft conditions here at Sandown. So let's have a look at the runners. Top spec for Alex Cherry, my guardian angel for Obi Wan. Can he need do that for Stu Gray? Fine fettle for David Robertson. Man from Afghanistan for Martin Leadham. Usually small for Daniel French. Borough Hill Lad for Darren Howes. Miss Larwood Arctic for Doug Warren. Uncle Bunge for Obi Wan. Claustrophobic for Kevin Meanham. Phillipstown, that's for Darren Howes. Heather Oscar for Doug Warren. Jamaican Ride for Stu Gray. And Siffert for James Follis. And 15 is Tiny in Black for Alex Cherry. 15 of them to go around this little sand down course. Starter's already got him on his way. And it's Obi-Wan's Uncle Bunge that goes sprinting off into the lead. He wants to get to the first fence first. He does. And everybody gets over it. So it's Uncle Bunge into the second. Oh, and Top Spec, who is in second place, went through the top of it. So it's starting obviously down the back straight here, but I'm not sure. I'll wait till... Uh, it's a nice ditch there as they go over the third. Oh, we've lost one there. Bad luck, Doug. That's Mr. Larwood Arctic's gone. Doug's had some really bad luck in the past few weeks. He's had a winner since uh, about week seven or eight. Good luck for the rest of this week, Doug, if you've had a winner, and obviously next week. But anyway, let's get back to this race. I'm waffling on. All right, they go over the fourth. And the lead into the railway fences here. And over the fifth. And then to the sixth. It's like show jumping, isn't it? Anyway, so uh, it's Burry Hill Lad that leads us from Uncle Bunge in second. Then we've got Top Spec in third. Fine Fettle the Grey is fourth. On the outside of that is Kenny Nee. Do that. And they've got about four links on my Guardian Angel. And a further three back to Phillipstown Bats. Heather Oscar and Usually Small. And a further couple back to Claustrophobic Siffert. I can't see Tarnine Blackman from Afghanistan or Jamaican Ride, though I can now. Uh, at the back is Jamaican Ride on his own. So we're already through seven of the 18. We will get over that one here. So they'll have another 11 fences to go, and just under two miles to travel. And it's just Uncle Bunge on his own up front now, by a length or so to Burry Hill Lad. And we've got Kenny Nee do that in top spec. And their number in fifth place is Fine Fettle on his own. They're going to the eighth, the leaders are over it. And so is everybody else. Looks like Jamaican Ride's going up, going for another pull up. Over the ninth, half the fence is done. Up front is Borough Hill Lad, Uncle Bunge, Top Spec and Kenny Nee do that, just a length between the four. Then we're a couple of lengths back to Fine Fettle, and a further length back to my guardian angel, Phillipstown Lats. And then two from Claustrophobic, Heather Oscar, usually small, tiny and black man from Afghanistan and Siffert. And then we've got about six back to Jamaican Ride. So as I go away from the grandstand now, for a circuit to go, about a mile and a half across the road there. What well, road that is? I call it the I don't know, the Suffolk Street. But as they come downhill now, here at Sandown, it's Uncle Bunge that's going to lead them into the tenth with Borough Hill Lad, top spec. Can they do that just a length behind? Well, it's made up a little bit of ground. That is fine, Fettle, as is my guardian angel with Phillipstown Vats. Well, they are a bit Indian file. It's uh, between the top sort of seven. There's probably five to six lengths. And a couple of lengths back to the chasing pack, just being led by Claustrophobic now. So we finally get to this tenth fence. And the back straight. Uncle Bunch has been joined by Burry Hall Lad now. And just on the outside of that is top spec going into the tenth. The leaders are over it. As is everybody else. Into the eleventh. I don't know why they're called the railway fences. I'm sure somebody does know the... Maybe they weren't the railway fences. Maybe these are the railway fences. Everybody's over it. That's 12 done. And they go to the 13th. It's top spec that leads us from Burry Hill Lad, Uncle Bunge. Then we've got Kenny Nee do that and Fine Fettle. And about three links back to the Grey Phillipstown Vats. And two back further to Claustrophobic and my Guardian Angel together. And then a length back to Tarney and Black. They get to the 13th. Everybody's over there into the 14th. 
Oh, we've lost one there. Tim Tarnin Black's gone for Alex Cherry at the 14th. So we're through 15 now. There's only three left to go and just under five furlongs. So up front is Canyon A do that. Top spec and fine fettle. I'm going a little bit slow now. His uncle Bunge has got to get second wind to go from there. Borough Hill lads running on well, as is my guardian angel. On the wide outside is claustrophobic. Usually small is also running on well. But up front, it's top spec, fine fettle. Canyon A do that. Being chased down by Borough Hill lad and my guardian angel. Got three and a half furlongs left to run. We've only got a couple to jump. It's top spec still leads. It fine fell moves up on his outside. Reaches the 16th first. Gets over it well but not can get away from it so good. So back in front is still fine fettle. Top spec. Can he they do that? Running on well now is my guardian angel. It's these four starting to pull away. I'm not sure anything else is going to win from here but it's fine fettle. My guardian angel is trying to run him down inside the final two. It's fine fettle. My guardian angel over the penultimate. A great jump there by top spec has put him into second but I'm not sure they're going to catch fine fettle here. Seems to have a little bit left. Going to get over the 18th he does another great jump by top spec but not enough to to get fine fettle fine fettle with just half a furlong as they go up here now fine fettle is going to take this with david robertson my guardian angel for everyone looks like he's going to be second third is going to be top spec sif run on well for fourth i think fifth was man from afghanistan for martin leadham we're just going to wait to have a take a look at the replay from our aerial camera here Fine felt just slow up a little bit there, but then we're never going to catch him. He was the favourite. So that's Sandy Can, Sandy Can, Sandy Can, Sandown, Handicap Chase goes to Fine Fettle for David Robertson. Second was My Guardian Angel for Obi Wan. Third was Top Spec for Alex Cherry. Fourth was Siffert for James Follis. And fifth was Man from Afghanistan for Martin Leadham. And we seem to have a fair amount of minutes to waffle on here, so maybe I'll carry on talking. Now that's it, guys. Is that join me for the last race of the day, race 32.